Benny, well done. You're finally acting your age, Mum exclaimed. Would she give me the compliment if she knew what I had done? I've lost my oyster card. How can I tell Mum? I've lost my oyster. I tried to make myself sound blameless. Mum was exasperated. Benny, look at all the things you've lost. Like your swimming goggles, your oyster card, your keys, your scarf, your trainers, your PE kit. The list is endless. You have gone back to your old ways, she cried. Providentially, I was running late, so I had an excuse to miss the rest of her lecture. I grabbed my bro's oyster and ran out the house. I ran to the bus stop and hoped to catch the bus, only to see it disappearing into the distance. I became cantankerous. I arrived late to Rokeby school. Now going home was a whole other ball game. However, the day went past like a flash. At the back of my mind, all I kept thinking was oyster, oyster and oyster. As I was leaving the classroom and going home, my friend Brandon saw my oyster under all the mess and scraps of paper. I jumped in ecstasy as he had relieved me of one of my grief. I walked home knowing my, my dad would be waiting. Benny, where is your oyster? My dad would say. I retorted in my most concited way. It's here as I flung it onto the sofa and strolled away, glad to have proven them wrong.